A group of six astronauts from different countries came to Maxwell Air Force Base to train on the leadership reaction course. The course throws different obstacles at the team and pushes them to work together to solve problems. It's being able to be effective as part of a team, I think, makes the team as a whole every day at work uh, a better place to be. Tip the board over so it's downhill. I think he's on something though, just for moving the strip. Honestly, every time we get everybody's opinions, we come up with a much better solution because someone's always got the trick that'll help us get through something. We're looking for challenges. We don't want something that's easy. We want something that puts a team outside our box, if you will, and, and makes us uh, you know, pick up from things that don't go well and, and do better next time. After each obstacle, they held a feedback session, which helped the astronauts learn to plan their strategies around what they could physically do. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, I think for us, maybe the challenging part is the physical part. Uh, because we're a little bit older than some of the kids going through the LRC. The <laughs> most challenging aspect for me was uh, just standing on a pillar by myself and trying to move a large piece of lumber around, I'd say. Oh, okay, I got you. One of the added challenges of the, the space program right now is the fact that it's international. So it's, it's not just Americans, it's Americans, Russians, uh, Canadians, Japanese, uh, astronauts from all different European countries working together on a space station. There's things that we take for granted when you're dealing with a bunch of people from the United States that we don't even realize we've got one way of looking at things that's in common. And sometimes they help us see things that we never would think of otherwise. By the end of the day, they learned how to identify their strengths and use them to complete the task. Air Force Staff Sergeant Michael Watkins, Maxwell Air Force Base, Alabama.